perfect. Truly magnificent. I have honestly chills. It's time to watch episode 10 of Free Rain Beyond Journey's End. It looks like Fern and Stark have just defeated their opponents, and now our focus will lay solely on Free Rain and Aura. It's time for the big battle. So let's tune in. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe to help the channel grow. Thanks. A memory. She looked so young. She was just a little child. Her master Flam was truly beautiful and stunning woman. They are vicious after all. And as we were shown, they don't deserve any type of kindness, understanding, pityness, as they wouldn't spare you any. Extremely deceitful and horrible these demons are in the story. Because I've already mentioned that in the past, that there are different animes, different stories, some demons, you know, you can reason with or you can sympathize. But in this case, in this very story, the demons are the real evil. And now there is no reasoning with evil. He won't disappear. It better be. Finish him, just finish him up before it's too late. But she's more powerful. Does she? <laughs> I wonder what it is though. I'm not quite sure what it is that she's doing, what kind of unfair magic she's using, and why she's called a disgrace. But she gets the job done. How Elf Village massacred. He was Freeran. Wow, so that's Freeran's past. How can she feel it when it looks like the mana aura is slimmer? So she got curious about Free Rain and decided to take her with her. So that's how it happened. Why? Just why? She didn't use her staff? Oh my god. Don't they need some sort of staff to channel the magic? Oh. So that's what it is. That's what Fref. That's what Fern did. I don't think it's unfair. I don't think it's unfair at all. Why would you be overwhelming someone and just showing off how powerful you are? It's better to keep your head low and observe, study your opponent and take them down. Wow. Oh, 
があるのかもしれません。第二喪失する魔力を十分の一以下に抑えたのさすがだね。よく制御できたわ。She was a little genius as well, and she still is. あとは並行して基本訓練だ。基礎的に出せるように。ああ。Always. All the time. Wow. Amazing. Which kind of helps her? But if Freeran releases all her mana, this is going to be epic, I think. But does Freeran know how powerful and massive her mana is? 500, but Freeran's been alive for thousand years. Interesting thing, Freeran didn't have any earrings at that time. But her master has a necklace that looks like Freeran's earrings now. Makes sense. So if Freeran can use it to her benefit, the scales are fair, right? There's also beautiful forms of magic in that world. Wow, she must have been cold in there. So. I thought that perhaps her earrings are for her master, but she's still not wearing them. I wonder what's the story of her jewellery. Wow. She just stayed there and she kept training and training. That's how they met her! Just what she said to her master. Oh, wow. <laughs> she never lost yet, did she? Oh, really? <laughs> oh, well played, Freeran.
<laughs> I bet she's laughing inside now. Release it. Release your mana. And she'll do it in an expected moment, right? The skills are fair. She did her a favor. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> but it did. <laughs> Indeed. How oh, thousands of years. Look at her, she's totally sweated. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Over. Take that. <laughs> Perfect. Truly really magnificent. I have honestly chills. Literally watching this anime you get that sense of fulfillment as if you were watching Lord of the Rings movies when the final battle happens and the army joins together and then there is the Gandalf to say everyone and here there is Freerin she's been trained so hard to conceal her mana to deceive demons pay them back for all this deceived for all the lies gosh I wish Himmel could see it but I'm sure he already knew how magnificent she was and still is oh beautiful episode can't believe we are on episode 10 when we had such magnificent battle I'm so amazed. Baron herself hides in the manor just as well as three renders because the other demon haven't noticed anything at all and thought he would exhaust her magic, but no. And she found an opening just when he was too distracted by a death of his comrade and <sighs> killed him. Stark himself remembered words of his master and didn't give up, defeated his opponent. So there's no regret on his side. And free ran. And that moment when she released her mana, honestly, my heart was beating so fast. <laughs> I literally had chills on my body. <laughs> I love it so much. Can't wait to watch more episodes, guys. A massive thank you for everyone supporting me on this YouTube journey. And big thank you to my patrons, particularly Isaac and the rest of you. Always liking, commenting, supporting me on Patreon as well as on the YouTube channel. Big thank you to the members of my YouTube channel. It's great to have you here. And honestly, you guys, and also you, who is always commenting, liking on my videos, thank you so much because that really tells me that you like my reactions and it really motivates me to do more and work harder for you guys and get better at it. For those of you who doesn't know, I do have a Patreon. You can find there over 150 videos in uncut, full length and 100% opacity, early released, which means that we are 
far ahead with every single episode on my Patreon. And there as well, you can find some Patreon exclusive videos, which you won't find on my YouTube channel. And you can even get a shout out in my video. So I truly encourage you to join my Patreon and discover the rest of the perks or simply join my YouTube community where you'll get a special badge, prior to replying to comments and access to special budget. All the funds that I raise from Patreon and YouTube goes towards my subscriptions for video editing programs, cosplay or just dressing up in general and everything else involved with video making. Please stay with me as we are going to get better. Thanks so much everyone and see you in the next episode. Bye!